Today we're thanking God for the victory that we have in Christ Jesus. That throughout this month, as we remember the death and the resurrection of Jesus, it reminds us that everything has already been paid. The shame, the sickness has already been taken away. So as we sing these songs this morning, please declare your victory. Declare what God has done for you. Receive it. We have a, we, it's already been done. We just need to accept it and receive it. In Jesus' name. Let's sing in Christ alone. In Christ alone, my hope is found. He is my light, my strength, my song. This cornerstone, this solid ground. From through the fiercest drought and storm. Here in the 
to declare that line to yourself that till he returns or calls you home that you will stand in that power of Christ begin to declare that and say Father Lord I receive my victory I declare my victory all mastery for victory whatever it is that I need as an individual say Father open my eyes that I may see what you're leading me to do in order to attain that victory what you're leading me to do in order to get to that place that you want me to be what you want me to do open my heart that I may see let me understand what it is that you want me to do oh God I receive my victory I claim my victory in the mighty name of Jesus we bless your holy name in Jesus mighty name we pray amen hallelujah give thanks to the Lord our God and King his love endures forever Okay, we're slight, we're changing our work set slightly now. Let's just go in. Let's keep praying. Let's keep praying. Begin to thank God. Thank Him. Give Him the glory. Give Him the praise. He's worthy of our praise. We worship You. We magnify Your name. We worship You by His stripes. Let's sing that song. We are here by His blood stains us. We're free by His blood. We wash clean. We wash clean. Now we have the victory. Sing the power of sin. The power.
name of Jesus over this place this morning. I don't know why <laughs> God is leading us down this way. This is not what we practice, but let's begin to say, Father, Lord, we declare your name, that name of victory over this room this morning. We declare that name of victory over this room this morning. There is power the name of Jesus there is deliverance in the name of Jesus there is salvation in the name of Jesus there is breakthrough in the name of Jesus at the mention of your name every knee must bow and every tongue must confess that you are Jehovah that you are Lord of Lords that you are the ascent of days we declare the name of Jesus over United Kingdom we declare the name of Jesus over the over Hosham we declare the name of Jesus in that situation we declare the name of Jesus in that problem we declare the name of Jesus we declare the name of Jesus we declare the name of begin to declare the name of Jesus there's no other name like that name Bible says that at the mention of that name every knee must bow it says therefore God exalted him and gave him a name that is higher than every other name that at that name of Jesus every knee must bow begin to speak to that mountain we just came from the deliverance service on Thursday if you know that you are walking in your victory begin to celebrate the name of Jesus this morning thank him for the victory that you have as a result of his son dying on the cross of Calvary thank him for the victory that you have as a result of being called a child of God thank you for salvation for sending his son to die on the cross of Calvary the name of Jesus is higher than any other name the name of Jesus is best than any other name the name of Jesus is greater than any other name we call on that name of Jesus we call on that name of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus we worship you we give you the praise we magnify your name there is no one like you keep praying keep praying declare that name of Jesus over this place this morning declare the name of Jesus over this place this morning we worship you we give you all the praise we magnify your holy name Take control. We give you glory, Lord, as we honor you. Please just open up your mouth this morning and just honor the Lord this morning. Just bless him this morning.
praying during the choir get together. We raised the prayer point about victory. And the Lord laid it in my heart that the reason some of us, even if we're going to enter into, into a march and come out the other side, most times some of us are still holding on to things. The Bible says, like, th there is only one driver. There can only be one driver. And it was laid in my heart that sometimes we are still trying to drive that car ourselves. We're still holding on to that wheel. And this morning, as we prayed, it was laid in our heart that we should pray for the revelation. Because no matter how much I say on this stage, God has to reveal to you what you need to do to see the victory. We're going to pray this morning and say, Father, Lord, open up my eyes. Reveal to me if there's anything that I'm still holding on to. If there's anywhere I am taking the will, Lord, this morning I drop it before your throne of grace. And I ask you, Father Lord in heaven, here is the will. Father, take the car. Be in the driving seat. Begin to pray that prayer this morning and say, Father Lord in heaven, the battle belongs to you. So this morning I choose to drop it at your altar. I choose to drop it at your altar. I choose to drop it at your altar. Lord, I give you the will. 